Joanna after 40. I think it's pretty clear <laughs> what's happening this morning. Uh, I'm filming this morning. I don't know. You may be watching it at night. Um, I went to Savers um, last week and um, I actually found out there was a Salvation Army um, a couple of towns away where the Savers is. So I checked it out. Um, it's great for basics and sort of lower end brands, but um, it clearly looks like people donate to the local savers. So I went over there and I kind of struck gold. We shall see. You let me know if you think I struck gold. Plus, at the end of this, I'm going to share with you um, an amazing story of meeting some unbelievable famous authors. So stay tuned for that. All right, so let's start with um, what I think is the best find. Kate Spade, red leather bag. Um, so $16.99 um, minus, I think I had a 20 or 30% off. Um, I think it's authentic. Um, it looks it. Um, I may have it authenticated if I don't, if I sell it, um, but it's in really nice condition. I'm just gonna do some cleaning on it, but it does have the Kate Spade all throughout here. Um, there is also um, a Kate Spade in here and a Kate Spade tag inside. So it looks pretty authentic to me. Um, it, it, it's great because it did also come with um, this, which is the shoulder strap. Um, so really, really cute, um, bag that you can wear with a handle or crossbody or just on your shoulder. Um, really, really nice sleek bag. So, um, really fun, fun, a little bit pricey, but, um, I thought it was worth picking up. The next thing that I got, um, was this pair of brand new Tom's. So these are for me, um, they are $6.49. They're the basic, you know, canvas toms. They're, um, you know, your run of the mill toms, um, but they're super comfy. I actually wear these um, like, like house slippers while I'm working because I work from home. So um, those are great. Next up, another item for me. Um, so I've been looking for some, you know, fun tops for the summer for, you know, while I'm working on Zoom. Um, so this is from Ann Taylor Factory. Um, it was $8.49 and it's a large. Um, just thought it was super cute. It looks a lot brighter on the screen. It's, a, it's, it's pretty bright, but, um, and then it has this like really cute bow detail in the back flowy with a pair of like shorts, leggings, whatever. So really, really pretty find um, in really nice condition. Um, I am sort of the unofficial queen of polka dots. I just love anything polka dot. Um, so I spotted this. Um, this is from Charter Club. It was $6.49. It's a large. Um, so again, um, can we tell I love polka dots? Um, this one though has different color polka dots and it's black. I have a lot of navy, which is this one. This one is from Loft, regular Loft. I think I got it last year. Um, so um, that's a find from me. Tried it on, super cute. The next one, <laughs> I think I showed you in another video um, the Argyle sweater that I found at my local goodwill that had like a 70% off because they're closing by the way reopening today I'll be there this weekend um so this was 10.49 um it is from Brooks Brothers it's a large women 100% cotton um really nice condition I haven't washed it yet <clears throat> but so me I love Argyle I tried it on and I was like so giddy <laughs> dancing around my bedroom my husband was laughing at me um so this is like a staple that will stay in my wardrobe for a long time. Great for navy pants. Um, what do we got next? Oh yeah, I picked these up um, for myself. These were $5.49, they're an extra large. Um, I tend to carry my weight on the bottom, so I usually size up. These are just some old navy um, active shorts. Um, not a huge fan of picking up um, like 
active wear for myself that's been used, but I gave these a pretty good test and I don't think they've been worn. Um, so just a cute pair of pink shorts just to wear around the house. What I liked also was that they sort of had like the built-in underwear. So um, just a little bit more, um, you know, privacy since they live with um, three gentlemen, um, enough said. Uh, there's more, there's more. Um, this was a great pickup. Um, I did try it on, it is too small on me. So I'm thinking it's probably like around a size eight. I have to really look it over and see if there's a size on it, but otherwise I will list it on um, Poshmark with its measurements, but just a really, really nice um, tank from Lululemon. Um, and I paid 11.49 minus 20%. So again, I had picked it up for myself, but um, I thought it would fit me, but it's just a bit snug. So I may end up um, putting it away, keeping it because I'm working on some weight loss right now. Uh, next up, <laughs> this was just too good not to buy. I think I'll post it. Um, it's just, it's from Alternative. It's a medium, um, but I, it looks like it's never been worn. Um, <laughs> it is, some things go, never go out of style, absolute. It's this really cute white and pink. I thought like maybe with the Barbie movie coming out, I've said I'm doing a lot of like Barbie related things. It's an absolute Cosmo sweatshirt. And you can tell it's brand new without tags, never been worn. So I'll be putting that up on my Poshmark um, if you're interested in it. I will price it fairly. Um, I got this pickup. Um, so this is an extra large. I paid um, $6.49. It's a BT21. Um, but it's the anti-anti-social club sweatshirt. Um, those go for a pretty penny um, online. I'm going to put something on the screen and show you. Um, and I have to do a little bit more homework on the one that I got, um, just in terms of like where it came from. But um, I don't think it's ever been worn. Um, you can usually tell maybe, nope. So it just needs um, just a little, a little research, but look at the comps. They're insane. <laughs> All right, last item, last item before we get to the amazing book, book uh, experience. Um, so I saw these in the pajamas section. Um, these are from Roller Rabbit, um, which is a great brand, um, great pickup. And they're a size small. So sadly, they're not going to stay with me because let's be honest, look at these little pants, but they're so freaking cute. Uh, they are, there's like little swans all over them. And these are new without tags. Um, and they were 1049. Um, so I will be putting these on um, either eBay or Poshmark, um, but like new without tags, um, roller rabbit PJs. Um, oh my gosh. I highly re recommend um, cotton or bamboo um, pajamas because they really help with um, regulating body temperature while you sleep. So um, those would be a great pickup if you're size small. Um, so I'm just moving the clothes back into the bag. Um, and, um, and let me tell you about these books. So it started with thrifting. So there is a, a correlation. Um, so I picked up this Jodi Picot book um, at my local Goodwill. Um, it's $28.99. Um, and let's see, when did this come out? Um, 2021. So it's pretty new. I got it for, I think, $2.99, um, which is amazing. There's Jody. Fast forward to Monday. I helped um, at an event for my job, my regular job, and um, I got to meet her. I met Jody Picot. Uh, she is lovely. I'm looking for the page that she signed so I can show you. There it is, uh, personalized to me. So um, Jody, if you're watching, I doubt you are. Um, thank you so much. Um, it was such a joy to meet you. Um, and then I also got to meet the amazing Lisa Genova. Um, if you haven't read her books, they're fantastic. Um, uh, Ask Alice is um, probably her most famous. It was um, put, made into a movie. Um, and um, I know that uh, she did Inside the O'Briens. Um, hopefully that'll be turned into a movie, but um, 
that was such an unbelievable read. It takes place in Boston, near where I live. Um, and then this one is actually more of a nonfiction. This is about memory um, because she is has her PhD in neurology. Um, so cool. And um, Lisa signed this for me um, as well. And um, also just a wonderful humble human being. Um, and then I got to meet the unbelievable Laura Zygman. And Laura, if you're watching, hello. Um, uh, this book is supposed to be really, really good. Um, it's got a lot of good buzz. I'm really excited. Um, and she signed it as well. I actually saw um, another one of her books in a thrift store in New York. I'm going to be uh, doing a video about my thrifting in New York if it hasn't been up yet. Um, and then um, one last book which I will show you. Um, this one, actually two more. Um, I found a signed copy of Lessons in Chemistry. Um, so I collect signed books. Um, so this book, I haven't read it yet, but it's huge. And then the last one, did not meet him, but pre-ordered this like around Christmas, just arrived. I got Tom Hanks book signed. Let me see if I can show you the old signature. There it is, Tom Hanks. I love collecting signed books. I do read them, but I have a whole collection. So started with the thrift store and ended with this. Um, so thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Bye, this is Joanna After 40. Peace out. Mm -hmm.